It's the 1st of March 2020. On a remote volcanic islet in the middle of the Atlantic, a 40 mile an hour wind has whipped up the seas into a frenzy, and a swell travelling from hundreds of miles away batters the rocky shore. This is the realm of ocean going seabirds, of petrels and sheer waters, which can be seen on the horizon, stiff winged against the wind and skimming the wave tops. Yet these winds have brought an unexpected visitor to the islet, one equally as resilient as these seabirds, yet seemingly fragile in such a hostile place. In the shelter of some tamarisk trees, a small, chunky moth zips from flower to flower, sipping nectar frantically with its long proboscis. This insect is a hummingbird hawk moth, a migrant who may well have arrived here from mainland Europe, over a thousand miles to the east. Not much bigger than a two pence piece, these remarkable moths are a common visitor to nectar rich plants in our gardens back in the UK often following southerly winds that aid their migration to our shores from the continent. Yet I did not expect to discover one here, on a small islet in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean. It gives me a new appreciation for the capabilities of these amazing little moths. After ten minutes feeding frantically on the hawk's beard flowers beside me, the hawk moth flutters off around the corner, buffeted by the raging winds, and then is gone. <laughs>